Did you look at this? Yo, what's up, sir? Hello. Hey, man. Nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you. I was a big, <laughs> a big fan of uh, your work at TI. Yes. Oh, really? Thank, thanks, man. Appreciate it. I... I've been watching a lot of your highlights. <laughs> uh, getting, getting to know Dora. It's, uh, it's really cool to see. Well, nice to uh, meet you. I'm. Uh, I, I don't know if I'm gonna be 100% able to uh, converse like we're hanging out for the first time because I'm like <laughs> playing the era for the first time. <laughs> You gotta focus on your game, man. You gotta focus on your game. That's what I've been telling my chat. I'm like, let him focus. Just tell me exactly what to do. I'll be the hands, you'll be the brain. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I gotta be able to watch your game live, though. And for that, we gotta add each other on Steam, but... Uh... Oh, go ahead. Just just add me. Uh, oh, yeah. What do you want to, what, what do you want to play? Um, something I'm not too uncomfortable with. To Maybe be... Alchemist? Have you played it before? I mean, anything that I'm, you feel like. I'm 0-3 on Alchemist, so I'm kind of yeah, putting exactly. my... <laughs> I'm kind of putting my faith in the uh, set we'll magic here. Work. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. <laughs> I'm an alchemist specialist. Okay. Are you an alchemist <laughs> mid specialist though? Uh, we'll make it work anywhere. Are you going mid? Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Hardest challenge of his life. It's actually... Uh, I mean, it used to be a good mid hero. Now a little bit less with the last patch because they removed uh, one of the camps. Yes, the small camp uh, over here. Yeah, exactly. It's too late to switch chat, and they're always right, so it worked they're out this time. Always right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see, coach friend. You heard him. It's him. Okay, yeah, maybe it's lit. In, in all these I'm, years, I'm in all these years that I never played Dota 2, and every now and then people would ask, and I always remembered two things that I hear the most. And I must say, there's a little bit of a bias for people that would have taken a break from or quit Dota and then started playing Heroes of the Storm. The bias is they quit. They found a reason to leave and they want something else. And so they are not the most reliable witness per se of what the game is like for someone that still loves the game and still playing the game so with that in mind what i heard the most was that dota 2 is very hard and that dota 2 is very toxic hey, and it's maybe enough. some of the like it's both partially true right mm -hmm. but it doesn't have to uh, ruin your joy and i haven't felt a lot of it yet maybe again there's a bias of people sniping me and wanting to have a good time and the fact that it's unranked and i have voice chats on zero percent volume so again there are some biases there and the truth may be a little worse than than what i've been experiencing but i don't think, I think that you have that a good point though yeah you have a good point because bad. you yeah and it's also like if you're focusing on these negative aspects as you go into the game and that's all you thought yes uh, that's all you've been taught about told about then of course that's what you're gonna notice but had i told you that dota is a great game as because of its complexity and the amount of you know like exactly. things that you can do you know, you'd be focusing on that and maybe not noticing the guy that's being a bit toxic or you know what i mean like yeah. i think you have a good point and i think we actually discourage a lot of newcomers just because of the speech that we have before they join the game yes yeah. and i never heard that like all those wonderful mechanics that i've just been enjoying the crap out of uh the skill expression in lane uh the meaningfulness of of the early lane even in a one-on-one -on -one, in a two-on-two -two. because heroes of the storm i like it a lot as well and i think it's fun and it has its own strengths but uh there's a there's a great level of meaning in the early laning in dota that is yeah. so enjoyable i never heard about that all i heard is well i'm so glad to be done with last hitting yeah and i actually enjoy last hitting i mean i play warcraft 3 that's it as well but yeah, there could be you, more of that. Do you want to do you want to buy a bottle? You think, or you want to buy something else I think, from the mid? I think I'm a bottle user probably for mid. Okay. okay, okay. So you could buy one then in that case. Okay. Uh, it's not part of the build though. It's soul ring, boots, and magic wands. What do you think? Yeah. I, I, I trust you. The other ones are decent too. The other ones are decent too. I think bottle yeah. is if you want to be a little bit more active and pick up the runes. Yeah. And if you don't, soul ring is gonna be better okay uh, what is the alternative to picking up the runes um not picking them up at all it's just this is coaching gold <laughs> damn uh, what, what yeah, do you I think, think of next i think you go for soaring that because you already bought the two gauntlets from the starting build okay 
So, Marcy, you're just gonna have to respect the fact that she can pull you into tower range oh. when the tower doesn't hit your creeps. So you just have to respect that. Okay, so no and further than this. this. Yeah, one way to fix it is to aggro the creeps back. So if you right-click the Marcy and oh, run back as the creeps on. start following you. Does that work on the range creep? Uh, uh, he's gonna pull you in, but you're out of the range. All good. No, it only works on the heroes, but we can practice that after, actually, in the, in demo. You'll Because that is something that you have to get used to, and it's gonna make you much better later. Oh, Invoker tried to kill the Marcy. Go, go, go. <laughs> well, you're getting big. You're farming well. You have the water runes on both sides that gonna heal your HP and mana. You can go for it. Okay. Yeah, up there. But yeah, I don't have a good. bottle. You said if I don't have a no. bottle, I don't go for the rooms. <laughs> it's still good to pick them up. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. It's not like a priority. Like, for instance, now the creep wave is more valuable than the water rune right. down there. But if you have nothing else to do, it's good to pick it up. Yeah. Oops. Oh! Lucky DPS. You got <laughs> Easy. <laughs> have you stacked camps before? Yes. Okay. You Which one do you think mechanic. I should stack after I kill a wave quickly? Mm, there's no camp here that's efficient enough. For now, it's better for you to stay on the lane. Yes. No. Why is everyone talking about Counter Strike? Tiptoe now. You're shaking my brood. What is the guy telling you to buy? Um, boots and magic wand. The uh, power okay. treads. I think you skipped the magic wand. You, you, okay. you should buy. Do you like face boots? Using face boots? Usually? I like face boots a lot. Uh, I also like oh. power treads so that I can cast cheaper acid spray and then still hit hard with the strength. Oh, like swapping. I think you should buy face boots for this hero because uh, your stun buffs your MS on a percentage base. So face boots is really, really nice. Your movement speed is gonna go up really high with face boots. She could have maybe swapped me, right? Yeah, but I think he's not so comfortable with the combo. Yes, uh, he did a very short range combo, and that's because he first did a gap closer towards me, right? Like uh, yeah. he was too close to me, isn't it? He swaps position with me. He doesn't swap with you. He bounces off his own creeps or heroes, basically. Oh. And he cannot. The first jump, he doesn't choose the distance. Only the second one. Okay, I'm gonna have so to the, read up what she does later. Yeah, I think the best is to demo mode it, you, you'll get a feel for it instantly. Does he want to take over from me, Pukna, or was this a gank? A support support for a gank? I do not know what's <laughs> happening through his mind. Well, that's a, that is a big mystery to me, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite moment recently was uh, enemy Sven, level 2. All he did was ganking careers. <laughs> he was level 2 when others were level 6. I was like, is this okay. a valid build, guys? You could give them credit for them trying to do something, or you could just be like, yeah. yeah. You, know, you never know what what state they are when they're playing, so you don't know <laughs> what's In happening. Inebriated. <laughs> yeah, exactly. After that wave, you can run to the jungle. Your okay. jungle. Because now it's efficient. You clear camps fast enough, you'll be back for the wave again. Okay. Yeah, run to the jungle, up the cliff. Yeah, exactly. Which one? And here, go, your, go, go. This, this camp. Then you'll stack the left one. I'll let you know. Okay, okay. Start farming this one. Yeah, so this is what you're going to do. You start auto attack. Okay, all okay. oh, good. Did you want to have... At, 50, at, at 53, you run to the left. Oh, you're gonna be late. It's okay. Yeah. So um, yeah. tell me what you were thinking, and I'll just finish inefficient creeping. So what I was thinking is, you start right clicking this camp, and you acid spray the camp to the left. Yeah. Okay. I know what you mean. Okay. I, I and threw then you would run I... to the. Yeah. And then you would run to the rune because it's it was six minutes, and you could have checked the rune on the top spots. Check so the it ruin. Was, it was, it was, uh, sorry. What? Uh, what do you mean? Check the rune? The rune, you know, there's a rune that spawns every. The gold from... one. No, the, so you have the water runes in the river that you picked up earlier. Oh, oh, okay, okay, that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I know what you mean. At, at six minutes, you have runes that are like power runes yeah. that are gonna spawn. Yeah, yeah. So one spawn top, it's still there. 
Just want to walk there? Oh, uh, yeah. is that the... You see this spot on the ground? Yeah. Is, is that the gray thing on the minimap? Exactly, this one. This uh. is a regen room. It's gonna heal you back up. Your life and mana. And now every two minutes, so minute eight... Top or bolts, right? It's gonna, it's gonna spawn and it's either top, like upside or downside. It's 50-50 spawn. You don't know where it is. Yeah. You cannot know. It's RNG with the game. And usually it's the mid laner's job to check the runes because they they can give you opportunities to gank the side lanes mm. depending on what you got. So in Dota, usually both mid laners fight each other to get these runes. Would you at all use ult now? Uh, you could, yeah. To yeah, yeah, you definitely boost your farm. Run back to mid after that, the wave is coming to you. And then it's gonna be the 8 minute rune. Okay. So usually what you wanna do from mid is you push the lane, so use your acid spray here. So that when you go for the rune, he cannot chase you. Oops. Because he has to deal with the creep wave. Or if he chases you, he loses the entire creep wave to his tower. Right. If that makes sense. And now you walk up, for instance, not to the rune. Yeah, check it. It's 8 minutes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. You get it in this. It's Gank useless, or not? Whatever. No, no, no. I think you farm. You farm. Okay, okay. You don't have your stun. But at least you denied it from him, for instance. Right. So. So here, what you could do is use the acid spray, but at the edge of the circle. Yeah, exactly. And now you want to hit these creeps so that they run back to you. Oh, and the right ones keep coming because they're angry already. Yeah, exactly. There is a. It's hard to be perfectly efficient with it, but uh, you could have had a better placement. There's a way to place it oh. where like all the creeps are constantly in the spray, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it comes with getting used to the pattern. Yeah. You're saying you're, um, you're doing great. So. only the edge, the absolute edge on the right side. Yeah, exactly. Because then it's gonna aggro both camps almost at the same time. You have nothing to do, you can just keep hitting. Yep, makes sense. Yeah. I don't know what she has, so I'm just gonna run. You, yeah, you have to run. Yeah, but uh, you you'll be fine as long as you run. Just don't man fight him. Yeah, run around. Yeah, that's perfect. You could run around the tower. He's gonna keep tanking. It seems he's committed. <laughs> yeah, he's very committed. <laughs> Easy. That's good. Get the next wave. He's dead, right? He might die. I think he. It's gonna be close. You're gonna lose your MS. Oh, Invoker. Wow. wow. Well, he has a name that fits. <laughs> <laughs> now you, yeah. What did Invoker do? Did he do a sun strike? That's a, that was a sun strike, yeah. Ah. So here you want to push in the wave, but safely soaring into spray. Yeah. You don't have your ulti, and then you're gonna check the 10-minute rune again. Okay. Your ulti is gonna dispel that if you want to, but you don't have to use it. That's a DD, that's cool. It's gonna boost your farm. I think you can go to your jungle, yeah. Focus on hitting the Radiance timing now, as much as you can. The what timing? The Radiance, it's the item that you queued up. Oh. So here, try try to go, go left, here, start hitting this camp, auto-attacking, and spray the camp that's up. Oh, it's okay, next time. Too far? This this was a little bit too far. Oh, yeah, yeah, aggro yeah. them though? Now it's gonna be fine. It's gonna yeah. keep aggroing back, you're yeah. gonna see. You can ulti if you want. Yeah. You see, they keep coming back to you. You don't need to do anything anymore. Yeah. See? Oh, because uh, part of them is always in the acid bomb. Exactly. That's why you gotta place it really on the edge. Which one would you uh, keep here? Um, I would keep the either the broom handle, the first one, or the second one, the tumblers. But the tumblers is maybe harder to use. It's gonna be about ganking. Keep the broom, yeah, yeah. Okay. And don't forget to give the other ones back, yeah. Nice. Would you ever get a clarity now? No, I don't think you need to. I think you, you'll be fine. Do I TP top? I mean, no, I think I think you keep farming. Get your Radiance. Okay. Actually, get a clarity and and send the courier to the secret shop. Because you're going to buy the Radiance once. Like, you're going to get it at once. Okay. Yeah. I forgot to use Soul Ring before switch. Acid Bomb, so... It's okay. It's not ideal. No, not ideal, but... No biggie. And now back to mid? 
Yeah, now back to mid. And I don't I actually don't know exactly how much radiance is, but I think you have it in 200. Yeah, two, almost. 270. Hopefully this Omni doesn't grief you. Exactly. You're so close to radiance. But I think. Okay, okay, all good. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Exactly nice. the. All right, that is a sick timing, by the way. Twelve minute radiance is, it's really crazy. Should I help? Yeah, you you could start fighting with radiance, but you don't even have to if you don't want to. Huh? Nice. Where did he go? He died to the ward. He tried to cast a spell. Let's try to get the mid tower. Okay. Yeah, you're gonna get it. Which one? <laughs> okay, this one. It's, Almost dead. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. So now, if you feel like it, fallen. yeah, you could play aggressively on their side a little bit because you're so strong. What? Do you want to go back after this wave? Yeah. Uh -huh. That's a little greedy. They were like one second death yeah. timer. Didn't overdo it this time. You can walk left with your fuck now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He has like no health. You're too strong. You're too strong. Yeah, that's not. You can still the stack. Yeah, that's good. So you want to hit and run? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Into oh, you the already acid. have the instinct. Yeah. She went right into the acid. Yeah, you're killing all of them. This guy dies too. Chasing down. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. <Triple kill. laughs> I knew you could stack ancients, but I didn't know you could stack ancients with enemy players. <laughs> How did you lose three games with this hero? Well, I, I had Twitch chat as a coach. <laughs> no offense, but Twitch chat is so really, is... really good in the absence of better, but... <laughs> Set coaching? It's going great, man. So, what do you want to buy next? You could go safe, like safe route and buy BKB. All right, keep running, you'll be fine. You'll be yeah. fine. You can play it safe and buy BKB, or you could buy a blink and, you know, keep being like, on top of them. We're strong enough them that we don't need to BKB so long as we don't couple it with extra stupidity. Okay. So then you could go blink. Blink dagger. Yeah. You're gonna have it pretty soon. So here, with the radiance, walk right before finishing the camp so that ah. these creeps start aggroing to you, you know? Oh, yeah. yeah. And then you can farm whatever you want. Like you could, yeah, farm the camp up. Exactly. Yeah. You want all the creeps to aggro, just like you have acid spray, basically. Yeah. That's why Radiance is so strong on Alchemist. It's good for you, but it's also an insane farming tool because of that. Uh, I forget how big the radius is. Let me check. 700 yeah, is it's, crazy. It's pretty crazy. And it, it works on in fog, right? So. Right. That's you why you can turn it off camp. so that you don't uh, sh sh mess up and show enemy players. Yeah, that's, that's something you could do too. You got your blink that you can send over. You want to max your stun. What did you... Oh, you... Uh, I personally like the other talent on level 10, but it's a... Uh, oh, uh, the, the unstable concoction radius. Stun radius, yeah. It's, it's very good. I think it's slightly better than this one, but maybe the guide suggested otherwise. I think uh, soon I'm gonna do more thinking okay. for myself. Yeah. If I play hero more than once. Of course. But uh, I'll, I'll remember that you said that. So now you want to ulti before the fight happens. <laughs> if you fight mid, probably you should look at the mid lane. Okay. The minimap, yeah. You can charge the stun already. Yeah. And then you're blinking in. The longer you charge it, the better. Yeah. It does more damage and it stuns for longer. He probably did uh, shallow TP. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, that was good. I think Omni will get you. Yeah, you're fine, you're fine. He takes zero damage from okay. stars. Okay. His ulti protects from physical damage. You're gonna stun yourself, you have to get out. No, no, I you cast can't... it on Axe. Oh, okay, I didn't see. Good job. You have to get out here. Okay. You go farm. This go feels so th uh, traitorous to me. <laughs> yeah, but you have to. It's like, you're not gonna... Partici like contribute anyways, you have nothing to offer to mm. the fight. Your auto mana. You can get yourself some clarities if you want. Yeah. So there's an unconventional build that you could do here, but I don't know if, if you want to go for it. 
you could buy uh, yes. Heart of Terrasque. The answer is yes. Could... <laughs> okay, so you could buy a Heart of Terrasque in this game specifically because you're so far ahead. It's gonna be too much HP for them to cut through. Okay. And then you'll do whatever you want in this game. Okay. Okay. Start with the second one if you can. Oh, sorry. Wait, I can still yeah. sell it? Wait, can I still yeah, sell you, it? You can, yeah, you sell it. Yeah. And I'll sell it again the and then I'll get the red yeah. one. Yeah, and. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah! You're gonna be untouchable when you have this. So basically you're stunned, the longer you charge it, uh, as soon as they see you charge it, they will try to run away, so the way you want to do it is you start charging in fog, so you have to anticipate the fact that the fight is happening or about to happen, charge it, load it in the fog, mm. and blink, you know, like, uh, just when you want to use it, if that makes sense. Yep. And then you're gonna come out of the fog with a, with a big stun. It's gonna be a lot of damage and a very long stun duration. Do I take Fan Brace over Brigand's Blade? No. Yeah, I think you can. Yeah. Okay. You have so much HP. Fan Brace gives you magic resistance. Uh, it does? Yeah, when it's on strength. Oh, well, I, I never read that part. Duh. A little bit, yeah. I think you want to keep the Soul Ring in instead of the branch when you do that. Just okay. in case. Oh, yeah, good note. Yeah, yeah that makes sense. Because the branch is pretty useless. Yeah, true. Just kind of risky, here. right? Yeah, but I, honestly, you're strong enough. I think it's it, it's a bit risky, but I I think it's a good play. It's a pressure play. I mean, they farmed everything here, but their wave is gonna come. Ten seconds in. Watch your heels. Do I ult here to kill the tower? No. You could. You could if you wanted to tank it, uh, but you're gonna take it. They're five heroes here, so you might not have to take this fight if you don't want to. That's a good stun. Yeah, one? you're kiting. It's good. You can, yeah. Stay with the Radiance effect, you know. Oh, just damage them from afar? Yeah, you could if you don't wanna. Oh, this guy's gonna die. <laughs> Were you trying to lose that? <laughs> Were you trying to get the last hit or are you just trying to attack him? Uh, no, just kill him, security kill. Okay, okay. I was just, <laughs> I was just checking, I was just checking. <laughs> I mean, it if it happens, like I don't mind. But... <laughs> it looked like you were trying to get the last <laughs> <laughs> It's kind of an instinct for me. As a okay. national, as a support, I don't think I have a support mind. Okay. It's not a, it's, it's not a bad instinct. Like, sometimes it makes sense to distribute the gold in a certain way. Mm. I've and never sometimes given it's that any thought, just yeah. But okay. offer that, that's like at higher level than whatnot, like economy-wise, but... Uh, which level? Uh, 20 ta uh, 15 talent, you think? I think the Acid Spray grants armor to allies is, is nicer. The okay. right one, yeah. How, ma how much is it, actually? It's 7, or I think 7, yeah, it's a lot. Set an armor, that's crazy. Yeah. Here you could ulti just to take their. Yeah, exactly. Now you're really untouchable. And Omni is buffing you also. And Invoker is buffing you too. So now the heart is gonna come into play. Because your team has so many buffs for you, and you're gonna be so tanky that they can never touch you. That's like team synergy, basically. Yeah. Who is giving me so much mana? Uh, they have mana boots. On one. I think Omni has mana boots. <laughs> You're diving fast, him. Get out of there! <laughs> okay, get, sorry. Get out of there! Yeah, the old chief gonna die. <laughs> You're diving the fast, and I can't believe it. I I saw Alan do it. <laughs> uh. Wait, did you fucking mercy like, like show some mercy? <laughs> let let them get out of base. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm ruining the scene, okay. But... <laughs> you just said that you, you want newcomers to <laughs> <laughs> show to experience it. And then you're diving the fountain. Well, you know... They got, uh, 
The only thing you're a smurf. You had a lovely speech too before every game, but then when the game begins, we had to censor a lot of words. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what Dota does to you. Uh. No mercy when Dota starts. Cool, we got the heart of Taras. Yeah, you're so tanky with the heart. You can literally just hit it your force. Like, I don't even know what they can do. Yeah. I'll test your theory. Let, let them just ignore. Yeah, ignore yeah. Just let them test <laughs> your theory. Keep hitting the tower, you know? <laughs> like, no matter what. <laughs> you actually might die. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> I think so too. <laughs> okay, but to be honest, Omni bailed on, bailed on you. He has his ultimate ready, but he did not believe. Yo, to be fair, you weren't <laughs> wrong. I can just hit their tier 4, so you didn't say what's gonna happen. <laughs> no, but I think that your team was not ready for this. They were probably like, wait a minute, this is scary. But it was not in reality. If they had this stream on, yours and mine, they wouldn't have bailed on me. Yeah. I only got scared, but yeah. he had no reason to. Mm. Yeah. Well, this is very educational for my teammates. I hope they end up watching this and end up uh, having that kind of faith. <laughs> in the future. Dora has a lot about faith. Mm. And teamwork. Man, he's really destroying them, this uh, A-Destroyer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, that is a stomp if I've ever seen one. Uh, the biggest stomp I've had. Yeah. No coincidence. <laughs> I mean, you're gonna check your net worth after like uh it's it's pretty wild and it, it slowed down because you you started fighting which was correct because you were so far ahead was but it? the first 12 minutes it's it, it was uh, almost perfect oh and they're suffering yeah do them do them that favor yeah Oh, it says uh, 3k over average, but that's for, uh, what's it called? That's for Herald, right? I'm not sure, but if you if you check here the, if you check the graph. Okay, I'll check. I can, I, I can check it too. I mean, look at this. <laughs> You're gonna see your, your net worth flying. <laughs> uh, performance, and then net worth. Okay, we are better. You go to... Oh, better no, than Immortal. No, oh, so... yeah. <laughs> Go, go, go to graph, you go to graphs, and then you click uh, player net worth. <laughs> that, that, that's you versus the rest of the world. <laughs> Dude. Well, we, we have a passive for it. Uh, the team never needed help. So like, you're gonna have a lot harder games if uh, the team cannot handle uh, the 4v5 uh, theory craft. And then you're gonna have to like, do you join more often if your team dies a lot or do you just play the same? but you definitely if you play alchemist you if they die they die to make space they should be dying to make space for you 